My dad was a small business owner. Um, the one time that he took away from work was to go on our annual vacation to Blowers Resort and the Little White Fish Chain. So that was the one, one time each season that we'd go it was to Blowers. So, and we'd met our family up there. We had friends that came from um, Indiana. So it was a nice pilgrimage and that's where our passion for the outdoors started. I didn't start bow hunting until I was in my early 20s. Uh, my husband introduced me to it. it the first time in my stand, um, I picked the area that I was in and my passion grew from there. So first time in stand, I shot my first doe with my bow and it's been part of my obsession ever since for the outdoors. Some of the other things that I think that our fees go to, if you will, for our, our permits, our licenses, our, all those things, are so many different programs that affect everything in this state on so many different levels. You look at the National Arts in the Schools program, the, the uh, BOW program, how essential that is in affecting women across our entire state and their children. You know, if the woman hunts, your, your odds are so much greater that your children will become the outdoorsman that that, that mother is, that the role model is. It's for the future of Minnesota. It's to further what we already have to make it greater than it already is.